Hello YouTube, it's Dr. Cena here, I'm a dermatologist working in the UK and today I'm going to be talking about folliculitis. So what exactly is folliculitis? Um, so folliculitis is the inflammation of the hair follicles due to any particular cause and it can cause tender red spots or pastel spots and it can affect anywhere on the body where there is a hair follicle but some of the most common areas tend to be beard area, thighs and buttocks. So what are the causes of folliculitis? One of the most common causes is infectious, for example bacteria, yeasts or viruses. For example acne as we most commonly refer to it or acne vulgaris is a type of folliculitis. And what people call fungal acne, for some reason it's a very popular term right now, is actually a type of folliculitis caused by a yeast called malassezia. I personally don't like the term fungal acne because it can cause confusion with acne vulgaris, which has a completely different treatment regime. As an aside on the subject of naming conventions, a further example is rosacea, which used to be called acne rosacea. However, the naming of the term was changed to rosacea to avoid confusion with acne vulgaris. Anyway, back to folliculitis. So basically it can occur due to irritation caused by contact with certain products, for example a particular occlusive moisturiser or certain oils. So if it's peak summertime and you're using an occlusive moisturising ointment and have an outbreak, this may have precipitated a folliculitis. Another couple of things to watch out for are ingrowing hairs, for example a wiry beard, and whether you own a hot tub, as this can trigger a particular type of folliculitis called hot tub folliculitis. And so certain disease states and forms of immunosuppression can also cause folliculitis, but that goes beyond the scope of this video and would need personalised medical care. So how do you treat folliculitis? So basically treatment really depends on the cause and you should see a skincare professional such as a dermatologist for evaluating it. However, general precautions would include avoiding tight clothes, avoiding shaving if possible, increase your hygiene around shaving, for example sterilising your shaver or cleaning your face. Uh, if it's malassezia folliculitis or fungal acne, an antifungal like ketoconazole cream may be useful. If it's bacterial or viral, it may need a swab and sensitivities to find out which antimicrobial it's sensitive to. However, generally an antimicrobial wash, like Dermal 500, would always be advised and useful in this scenario. So, if you found this video useful and informative, please do like and subscribe for more content. Thank you.